What's up with the Oasis and Meta partnership? Can Oasis survive the bear market? What are confidential smart contracts and confidential NFTs? Learn the answer to these questions and more in today's episode of Oasis Insights. Hey everyone, I'm Meredith, the Community Manager here at Oasis Foundation. If you want to see more content like this, make sure to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and leave us a comment. Welcome to the first episode of Oasis Insights, a monthly video series where we take the very best questions from the community and answer them. Let's jump in. Question one, what is a confidential smart contract and what are the benefits? Confidential smart contracts can be thought of as exactly the same as regular smart contracts with the added benefit that you're able to hide certain details of a transaction from outside observers. On a public EVM, if a trade is made on a DEX, then anyone can see the inputs and outputs associated with that transaction, such as if 1,000 USDC was exchanged for 1F. In a confidential smart contract, you're able to hide these details of the transaction so that someone can only see that a certain wallet interacted with a certain smart contract. Being able to hide these aspects of the transaction is a very powerful tool for Web3 and will provide many benefits to MEV, gaming, DeFi, governance, and many more. If you're interested in learning more about confidential smart contracts, you can view our confidential smart contract guide linked below. Question two, what are confidential NFTs and how do they work? A confidential NFT is just like a normal NFT that also gives access to some private data to the NFT owner. Because the NFT data is stored on Parcel, it can leverage Parcel's attribute-based permission system, allowing for privacy-preserving computation to be done to the data stored in the NFT. This capability is very versatile for many use cases, especially gaming. For example, a game developer could create a confidential battle game where the private data represents a character and the strength changes every week. You have to battle to know where you rank. Another idea that some of our gaming partners have shown interest in is attaching quest or lore information to in-game NFTs. Confidential NFTs are not just limited to gaming though. The ability to set permissions and do computation on data in a privacy preserving way is a huge step forward that will have an impact across all of Web3. Question three, how can I launch a game or dApp on Oasis? Are there any educational resources available? One of the best ways you can contribute to the Oasis ecosystem is by taking part in the development of new games, dApps, and Web3 projects. Many of you have already been asking us, how can I launch my project on the Oasis network? We're excited to announce the launch of Oasis Courses, a comprehensive educational guide focused on developing on the Oasis network. We already have two courses up and there'll be more in the coming weeks and months. Head over to oasisprotocol.org forward slash courses and start building. Question four, can Oasis Network survive the bear market? Many people are understandably concerned about the longevity of blockchain projects like Oasis during the current market downturn. We'd like to take a moment to share our thoughts on the matter. First, Oasis is here to stay. We're building a critical pillar to propel Web3 forward. Privacy is at the foundation of true digital ownership, and privacy is a central principle of the Oasis ecosystem. It's important to remember that the best new products and ideas emerge from these periods of market turmoil. When trading slows and people stop looking for the next moon mission, there's this really great period of heads down development that happens. We've seen this happen time and time again through previous market cycles. Every bear market gives birth to new and exciting ideas in the blockchain space. Web3 needs better privacy, faster and more scalable L1 solutions, true data sovereignty, and better cross-chain interoperability. Oasis is the only L1 that brings all these features together for the best Web3 experience possible. Oasis is not going anywhere. Question five, what's up with the Oasis and Meta partnership? And now we arrive at our most asked question by far. It's been a long wait, but we're so excited that we can finally share more details about what we've been working on together. Here's Vishwa from Oasis Labs with more info. Hello folks, I'm Vishwa, Head of Enterprise Solutions at Oasis Labs. We recently shared some exciting news. Oasis Labs and Meta have partnered to build a privacy-preserving platform that will assess the fairness of AI models that Meta uses in their products. But what does this really mean? Let's take a closer look. Meta is committed to building socially responsible AI systems that treat individuals and communities fairly. To make progress in assessing and improving technologies to advance fairness and inclusion, they're launching a first-of-its-kind platform for fairness measurement. Instagram users will participate in a survey in which they can voluntarily share their race and ethnicity information. But given the sensitivity of demographic data, this raises important challenges around privacy and security. As Meta's technology partner, Oasis Labs co-designed a protocol and built a platform that uses secure multi-party computation 
to provide a cryptographically secure system for users to provide this information. The properties of the system ensure that neither Meta nor the participants that perform the measurement computations can learn any of this highly sensitive information. The platform is unique and truly innovative, and we are thrilled to have been part of this incredible journey. Responsible data usage and ownership have always been at the forefront of our core vision, and this manifests in Oasis Technologies' focus on making it easier for developers to incorporate privacy-preserving data storage and computation into their applications. Decentralization and Web3 have the ability to enable individuals anywhere in the world to maintain control of their data. When combined with data privacy, this unlocks the ability not only to reach a global audience, but also build better products that usher a new era of equity, data privacy, agency, and transparency to all. Stay tuned for more developments soon. Well, that wraps up this episode of Oasis Insights. We have some great new content here in the works at Oasis, so make sure you like this video and subscribe to the channel for future updates. If you have a question that you'd like to see answered, leave a question in the comments or head over to our subreddit or Discord and feel free to ask there. See you on the next episode of Oasis Insights.